at it. How about another region championship bout? North Gwinnett and Norcross, these two teams, don't really like each other very much. It's our 680 The Fan Call of the Week. Doug Conkle and Carl World on the call. Eli Jordan provides the pictures. With identical 7-2 records, both teams have locked up first round home playoff game. Third down, call it three and a half. Ronning goes in motion, but it's Hall calling his own number. He takes it up across the 20, 25. He has some speed, 30, 35. He's outrunning a few people, crosses midfield, still on his feet. Tripped up from behind at the 35-yard line. They go four wide receivers set. Walters alone back to the backfield. Straight pass here is Hall looking downfield, launches it to the right side, and it is intercepted unless he can knock it. No! What a catch! Merrick Riley takes it away. The defensive back had the ball, took it to the ground, and then the ball flipped up in the air after he hit the ground where it was gathered in by Briley. Caden McDonald in the backfield. They'll follow behind him and Grant Godfrey stretching it out to the far side. Julian Waters runs over a man into the end zone for six. Watkins takes a snap, looking left, throwing left side, has a man breaking open and away, and it is caught for the first down and four as taking it in for the six, Zion Taylor. They'll bring Ronning in motion on the jet sweep fake. They'll throw wide open, Will Collins, 30. 40, lumbering across the midfield stripe. 40, still on his feet, cuts back inside, picks up a block, and he goes down hard at the 15-yard line. They're taking it on with their big guy, Caden McDonald, huh, wow. into the end zone for his first touchdown of the season. 14 to 10. And North Gwinnett, big winners tonight over Norcross 35-27. They are region champs. As we go to the bracket, there you see Region 7, Team 1. North Gwinnett will host a playoff game next week. Wheeler will be at Lambert, also in the 7A bracket. Pebblebrook at Colquitt County. Buford, the number one seed on this side. Coaches won't look ahead. We will look ahead. Look at the path Buford would have to take to get to the state final. Get maybe number six, Walton, in the second round. Maybe number four, Carrollton, in the third round. Maybe then... Call quick count. It's going to be a rough one for Buford, but they're still the favorites. Other side of the bracket, North Pauley, who we saw earlier. First region title for the Wolfpack since 2013. Congratulations to them. We also know Meadow Creek will be at Mill Creek next week. Also, Hillgrove beat McEachern in the Battle of Powder Springs to get into the playoffs. They will be the number four seed out of Region 3. They will go to Grayson next week. We also know it will be Cherokee at Milton next week. Let's go to the...